Now, you bought a Mac after years of using a PC, and then you're looking at the keyboard and you see that there's something different about it. It has a delete key, but it has the delete key is the functionality of a backspace. So where is the delete key? In this video, I'm going to show you where that is. So let's take a look. Now, if you're a Mac user, you're thinking, um, why do we need a that another key? We already have a delete key, which functions as a backspace. But for PC users or some PC users, they're used to the backspace and the delete key because I guess it's, it's a lot more uh, productive where you can delete a character on the left of the cursor and on the right of the cursor. And, and that's where um, that functionality comes in. Uh, let's, let's take a look at that on the keyboard. Okay, so this is something I just made up on ChatGPT. Anyways, we're going to use what we learned now to delete those red asterisks. Now that we have the delete key and the function delete, we can delete the characters to the left or to the right, depending on where our cursor is. So let's go down and let's go to our first set of asterisks and we're to the right of the asterisk. So we can just hit the delete key, which will delete all those asterisks. Now we'll go to the left and now we do have the ability to delete the character to the right. So let's hold on the function key and delete those characters. Okay, so it just adds flexibility. So delete and function delete. Just like that. Now I hope this helped you out. I don't know why I never thought about looking this up until now, but I just figured it out. I just wanted to share it with you and maybe it will help you too. If you like this, click the like button and share it with your friends. Until next time, aloha.